Okay, good morning. I um, hope everybody can hear me. My name's Matt Gregory, so I'm a supervisor and a fitness instructor at Sport and Wellbeing. Today I've been asked to take you through a workout for the legs. Now, today's leg workout is going to be focused on music content, um, but first we've got to get do a little bit of warm-up. Please remember, make sure that the space around you is nice and clear and nice and safe. So, welcome to my living room. As you can see, I've got a lot of space around me. Um, just as a word of warning, go careful where you step in. I practiced it on my deck in the other day, and unfortunately I did step off the deck in, so it is very, very, very important that you mind out what is around you. Also, if you are on any medication, if you do have any health problems or anything like that, please, please go careful, especially if you've got any injuries or illnesses. Uh, make sure you're nice and safe and you're nice, nice and comfortable, especially in the stretches. Because the mu it's going to be done to music, uh, there's going to be a lot of timings put in there. We're focusing on time under tension today. So making the movements like squats and lunges nice and slow so you really get that muscle contraction, you really get that time under tension. Uh, without further ado, uh, let's get warmed up, let's get started. So we're going to do a little bit of stretching to go for. Let me grab the music. Let's go through. This way, drop down. Okay, hopefully you can hear that. We'll turn up a little bit louder. There we are. Okay, so just jog in that spot. Get yourself nice and warm. Now we're going to start moving that knees and open up these hip joints. So over the top, in, out, good. Knee up and over the top. Jog it out each time in between. If the music does go a little bit loud, please let me know. I can turn it down. Open. Get that hip joint open. One more each leg. Okay, over, over the top. Imagine stepping over a hurdle and get that hip open. In, step. All right, one more each leg. All right, let's turn down a little bit. Okay, with those legs, we're going to be swinging forwards and backwards and changing our legs. So kick that leg forward, couple of steps, other leg. Kicking forward as we go. Just releasing those muscles, getting nice and warm. A couple of steps in between each one. Kick forward. Okay, two more on each leg. One, and then another. Okay, so this next one, we're gonna try and release the hamstrings. Get yourself into a nice position here. We're gonna crawl forward into a high plank, and then walk it back. So we walk forward, come in, and then we walk it on back. Slight bends in the knees. If you do have any tension in your hamstrings, you can bend a little bit more. The walking on forward, make sure you get that tension and that stretch in those hamstrings. All right, two more of those. Walking it on forwards. Walk it back, take it nice and slow as we rise. We don't want to get that head rush. We want to get those muscles nice and warm. Okay, the last one, slowly raise up. It's a little bit stretching into the lunge position. I'll go from the side. Take a nice long lunge forward. To the floor. Rest it down. Push those hips forward. Open up these hip flexors. Raise that chest up still. And lean back into a hamstring stretch. Pull that toe back towards you. Gently lower that chest down. And raise back up. Come to a stand. Change the legs over. So down slowly, open up that hip joint. Open up that hip flexor. Hold it there, chest elevated. Lean back into a gentle hamstring stretch. Chest down. Now don't worry, we're gonna be doing some stretches up top, just in case you can't get all the way down. So stretching those quads out. Get a nice stance, find your balance, hold on to something if you need to. Grab hold of your ankle, heel goes to the bum. Knees stay in line. Now what we're going to do is push those hips forward. We open up those hip flexors a bit more and get a little bit more stretch. Try and make sure that heel stays close to the bottom. Or restrict it coming away. Just squeeze that bottom, push those hips forward. Coming on down. Change your legs again. If you need to hold on to something, do so. But find that balance. Heel goes to bum. Squeeze that bottom, push those hips forward. Open up these hips a little bit more. How you doing today, you all right? You staying safe? Yeah. Shake your legs out, right, into that hamstring stretch standing. 
What we're looking to do is step that foot forward, back, hands go on that knee that's bent. Keep our chest slightly elevated. Now if you need to go a little bit deeper, pull that toe back towards you, just you engage that calf muscle. Now we've been working the calves a little bit today, on one or two of the tracks. Lean the chest down if you want to for that deeper stretch. But we will be holding these a little bit longer at the end for some developmental stretches. Other leg steps forward, last stretch before we get into it. Again, pull that toe back towards you and point it to that ceiling if you need that a little bit deeper and to engage that calf. Or stretch that hand down just a little bit more. It goes right at that hamstring and into that glute muscle. And slowly elevate, make sure you don't get that head rush. Shake his legs out. Okay, let me just change the music. So, what we're going to be doing today. So the time under tension element, what we've got is we're going to start with a squat track. So we're going to focus on taking those feet just outside the hips. Now the time under tension means we're going to be taking it nice and slow to the bottom and then nice and slow to the top. Now there will be some timing changes and I'll try and make sure the music's at a good level and after each one I'll see if it's a little bit too loud and I'll apologise for it. We want to make sure that the glutes, the hamstrings, the quads and when we engage those calf muscles with a couple of calf raises later make sure that tension is nice and good. If you can't get all the way down for the squat, if you do have any problems, just go for that half squat. So you can go to here, as long as you get that range of movement that you know you're comfortable with, it does matter. The focus is trying to get down and keep that chest elevated and sink those hips down. This is for the squat position. For the lunge position, we want to take a nice lunge back. We'll be going to get that knee down, get that nice 90 degree angle in the front knee, and come back. Now we'll be working on front lunges, reverse lunges, and also that side step with a nice squat in. So like I said, don't be like me and step off a deck in or wherever you are. Make sure you've got enough space behind you. Right, we're gonna change the music now. Okay. Do those feet just outside those hips. First track, focusing on squats and that time under tension. Feet just start to those hips. We're going for four seconds down, four seconds up. Follow me, let's go. Four, three, two, one. Slowly rise, keep that chest up. Get that tension in those legs. Good. Down to that seat position or wherever you're comfortable. Okay, two down, two up. So we go one, two. Same range of motion, same range of movement. Two more. One, two. Last one, we go into 16 singles. Timing, let's go. Down, up. Now if you need to use your hands to get that timing, to sink those hips down, let's do it. We hit that beat every time. So get up loud in those living rooms. Now push those heels into the floor. Push those toes to the side. Four, three. All right, two more, and then we're gonna squat with that calf raise. Watch me, let's go. Squat, raise up on those toes, keep nice and high, up. Now if you can't do the calf raise, just stay with that squat. Two more, last one. Okay, take that foot a little bit wider. We're gonna hit those side glutes now. Two, two tempo, so we go one, two, two, one, and again. Good. Back stays nice and straight. We keep that chest up. Four more. Slow, slow. Count it out in your head if you need to. One, two. One more time. Next back, that four down, four up. So we go. Four, three, two, one, up. We're loading those legs. Big set at the end. Down. Up. Keep going. Four down. We're winding it. Legs. We're sinking those heels into the ground. Slow. Last one. We hit those 16 singles. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Singles. Down. Up. That beat kicks in. We dig our heels down. We try and separate the floor beneath us when we're digging down. 
That's it, keep going. Sing those hips down. Challenge. Get lower if you can. Four. Three. Two. You ready for those calf raises? Next set, let's go. Down. Push, elevate on those toes. Make yourself as tall as you can. Remember, if you can't, don't worry. One more. Back to normal singles. Let's go. Finish strong. Get lower. Good. You feeling nice and warm? Keep feeling those legs. Last one. Stand. Check them out. Okay, next track. We're going to go for lunges. Okay, so in your next track, we're going to start on the left leg. We're going to do some static lunges. So the leg is going to go back. Like so, nice long lunge. From here, we're going to get that nice slow movement down and back up. That chest gets elevated, sorry about the line. That nice slow movement. Now what we're also looking for in this one is some front lunges. So when we step, instead of stepping back, we'll step forward, nice. Get that knee nice and down and keep that chest elevated up. Let's get ready to go, lunges. Watch out for the changes on this one. How was the music? Was it good? Good. Thanks for good technique. I'm glad. All right, let's push them through. Start left leg forward, right leg back. Two down, two up, chest up. Let's go. One, two, two, one. Control that breathing. Down, down. One more, stay on the same leg, four down, four up, let's go, four, three, two, one, feel that tension in that leg, slow up, one more, down, slow up, control it, two down, two up, let's go, one, two, two, one, you should be feeling it, right in that front leg, down, down, all right, one more. We've got seven single dips. You ready? Stay same legs. Here we go. Down, up. Keep that chest elevated. Don't allow that knee to go over that toe. Straight up, straight down. All right, change legs. Right leg forward. Two down, two up. One, two, two. Now, right now, you're probably thanking yourself that I change legs. What are you thinking of me? One more, down, down, all right, keep going. Sorry, four down, four up, four up, two. Sorry, I missed timing. And again, four down, four, three, two, one, up. All right, back to those two down, two ups. So we go, one, two, two, one. That long lunge. Now I'm feeling warm. I don't know about you. Last time. All right, seven on that right leg. You ready? Let's go. Down, up. Now after the seven, we go straight into alternating front lunges. One more. Step back, get some space, front lunges. So we go, step, back, chest elevated. Push that floor away when you come back. Left leg goes forward, four down. So we go, four, three, two, one. Up, step back, right leg. Four down, four, three, two, one, four up. Change legs, four down, four, three, two, one. Up, those tension that legs. Change legs, last one. Down, two, three, four, slow up. Control it, don't let go. Well done. Lunge track done. Shake those legs out. Let me just grab my water bottle. Oh. Whoa. Excellent. 
How you finding it so far? Good? Fantastic. Okay, so changing into that squat track. Now I know it's not quite there, but the track's called Wasted Summer. So what we're looking to do is get these nice tone legs ready for the summer. So that sun's coming out. As soon as everything's finished, all the dust is settled, we can get out there and show the efforts we've been putting in in these classes. Okay, squat track. So something slightly different. We've still got the sets of 16 single lunges, but the times in this one is a lot of slow descent. So we go three and one. So we go three, two, one, and we power to the top. We're looking to squeeze those glutes, really press those quads up to our ceiling and get that power element. So slow to start with, power back up to the top. Let's get some more squats going. Let's get a beat kicked in. If it comes in, there we go. All right. Feet just outside the hips from here. So we're going to dig those heels in. We start with that three and one. Slow down, fast up. So we go three, two, one. Power to that ceiling. Three, slow start and power. Squeeze to the top. Use those legs, press in. All right, eight singles. So we go down, up. Remember, push that floor away and apart. So push, good. Dig those heels in, point those knees to the side. One more. Three and one again. So three, two, one, squeeze. Slow, then power. Two more. Last one. Next time, time and change, one and three. So down fast, down, slow up. So, quick. 16, let's go. Push, stand. Keep that chest up, shoulders back. Be proud. You're digging deep, you push those heels into the floor. Eight more, let's go. Down, up. Can you get lower? Now these legs are warm. We can go a little bit deeper. Let's go. One more. Check your legs out. Slightly wider. Back that three and one again. You ready? Let's go. Three, two, one. Power. Slow, slow, slow. Squeeze. Squeeze that bottom at the top. Press those hips. Eight singles at the top. Let's go. Down. Two. Heels dug in. You feeling that? We've got one more track after this. Then we cool down. All right, back to that three and one. Slow, then fast. Three, two, one. Push. Down, down, down. Power. One more, then we'll reverse it. Quick down, let's go. Down, slow. Good, and again, down, slow to the top. Two more, and then big 16 to finish. Push those knees to the side, get as low as you can. Let's go, down, up. On that beat, it kicks in. We obey the music, push. You ready for it? Eight more, let's go. Down. If that still doesn't wake you up and warm you up on a Monday, I don't know what will. One more. Slow, down, slow. Three, four, up. One more time, let's go. Four, three, two, one, slow up. All right, shake those legs out. Awesome, well done. Okay, so lunge set to finish. Now your lunge set has a couple of combinations in this one. We're looking to go 360 degrees using both legs. For this, we're gonna step forward, we'll start with our left leg. We step, we take it down for two, up from this position, we step, and then to the side. Make sure I'm in camera shot. 
So we come step back to the side, that middle squat. Then we take that step back and we do a two here. The next set of combinations is gonna be singles, working round, and then we're gonna do what we call like duck lunges. From here, we stay low to the ground. So we're gonna step here, stay low to the ground, step in here, and then step behind. So all our body is kept at this low point where we go front, side, and then back. And then a short pause in between. Make sure you stay nice and low in this. Really engage those hips and get 360 degree. This is where I stepped off my decking the other day. So please, please, please make sure you have enough room. I'm going to step slightly forward just so I don't kick my couch. All right, let's go. Lunges. Okay, so we're going to start left leg alternating each side <laughs> with that front lunge. Foot goes forward, two down. So we go one, two, two up, step in, side, down, down, up, up, step, back. Change leg front, down, down, side, down, down, up. Back, down, down, other leg again, front, down, down. Now if you don't get a time, don't worry. No rush, step back, two down, one. Pick it up, pick it up, front, down. Step back in, side, down, down. Back. Forward, so singles now. Step, step, side, back, front, back, front of the leg, side, let's go, back, forward left leg, side, back, front of the leg, one more side, one more back. Shallow, shed legs up. Ready? Nice and low. Keep your legs to get around. Three, two, one. So in, side, back, stand. Front, side, back. Stay low. Back. Get that movement at that hip. Move inside. Good. In, step, down, up, and again. Front, side, back, good. One more. So we go in, sorry. Two, two, front, back. Shall I that? All right, let's go. Down, one, two, stand, step back. One, two. Change leg, let's go. Down, down, up, step back. Same leg each time. Left leg. Back. Other leg. Up, back, down, down. Single time, let's go. Other leg, right leg. Step back, right leg. Left leg, let's go, finish strong. Last movements. One more that right side. Ready, finish. Awesome work everyone. Okay. So that's the main bulk of the exercise done. We're now gonna go into some stretching. Release that lactic acid, take, catch our breath, and get going. Whew. Okay, so make sure you have a mat or something with you, just so you can stretch down. Now I'm gonna stand in front, we're gonna do our standing stretches to start with, and gradually move down onto our mat. So let's go into that quad stretch, find your balance, pull that leg, Heel to bum, stretch that cord out. Squeeze those glutes, open up those hip flexors, push them on forward. 
squeeze a little bit harder. We're holding it a little bit longer. So developmental stretch means going putting the muscle under a little bit more tension for a little bit longer. So we relax into it. Every couple of seconds, we're gonna pull a little bit harder and squeeze that muscle a little bit more. Contract it just so we get that stretching a little bit harder. Okay, squeeze a little bit more on that leg. Find that balance, hold it, hold on to something if you can. And slowly release that leg. Other side. So find that balance. Heel goes to the bottom, knees go in line. We squeeze the bottoms, whoop. And we push those hips forward. Now release that hip flexor. Pull that heel to that bum if you can. Squeeze and push forward. Hold it, hold it there. Now relax, push a little bit more. Hold it there. One more time, pull, push a little bit more. And relax. Okay, going into the hamstring stretch from the standing. Step one foot forward, hips raised back. So push back, sink those hips back to that rear heel. Chest can stay up if you wanted to, to get the oxygen in. If you're breathing heavy like I am. Okay, pull that toe back up towards you and sink a little bit deeper. So again, we're holding this for a little bit longer. Elasticate those muscles a little bit more. So next time, a little bit less tension in them. Sink a little bit deeper or stretch down. Pull that toe towards you. Try and make a point to that ceiling at least. And sink those hips back. Slowly raise that chest so we don't get lightheaded. Step the other foot forward. Sink those hips back. And see. Whilst we're here stretching, just to let you know that we do have the Does You Good coach who's currently on Twitter. So if you do have any questions about today's class, please ask them or drop it into the comments at the bottom. Um, alternatively, they're on between 10 and 12 every day and they're also on between three and five each day. So you do have any questions, sorry, sink a little bit deeper into that stretch. If you do have any questions about our classes, about the Does You Good campaign, or about anything to do with sport wellbeing, please drop us a line, please check us out. Stand up, stretch. Okay, we're gonna take it down to the floor now. So get that mat ready. Yeah. What we'll also do is the Sport Wellbeing Does You Good campaign page. I'll put in the comments section of this live post. Push that hip forward. Open up this hip flexor, just so you've got something to look for. Any of you that did the workout today with me, thank you for joining in. Sing a little bit deeper. Please, please, please share your workouts on all our social media platforms. Let us know that you're safe and you're still working out with us. We do miss you. Mm -hmm. Okay, sink those hips back. So we're gonna go to that hamstring stretch and we can sink a little bit deeper. Those hamstrings will be nice and warm now. Chest goes down towards that knee. So it goes back towards you. Now, if you can't get it down, don't worry about it. Go as low as you can. Just take a nice, relaxing breath. So what we're looking for is a deep breath in. As we breathe out, we relax into that stretch just that a little bit more. We try and relax. Excellent. Turn that knee under. So we're going to open up these hips a little bit more. So we're going to connect our front foot with our back knee. Chest stays up. Now, one hand goes either side of that knee. And we just lower our chest down. So we stretch that glute a little bit more. We open up that hip. Let's push down. Relax into it again. Sorry the coffee table's in the way. Don't know if you can see it from now. I do apologise. I'll try to move it a little bit. There we go. That'd be better. So, into that hurdle stretch. Connects that front and back knee. Chest goes down. Sink into it. Deep breath in. Relax down. Slowly raise up. We're going to stretch the other side. So, other foot, connect front foot, it's that back knee, one hand either side, again, deep breath in, lower that chest down, relax into it, just feel that stretch in that glute, and then that hip, and again, it doesn't matter how low you go, it doesn't matter how flexible you are, just relax into it, and cool down. Okay, so this takes us onto our other legs, into that hip flexor stretch, one foot goes forward, we're looking to push that deep lunge, open up this hip flexor, chest stays up as we go on in. Push a little bit harder, sink into that stretch, really open it up. Get all that lactic acid coming out of these tight joints. Just open them up where we put them under tension. Lean back into that hamstring stretch, so we're going to sit back. Come down, chest goes down towards that knee. 
again as much as or less you can do it doesn't matter it's your workout just take that deep breath in relax down into that stretch pull that toe towards that ceiling if you can excellent slowly lift that chest slowly stand up last stretch for me before I go step one foot behind the other we're just going to put the hand behind the back stretch up and over just stretch the IT band out all the way down step the other foot behind hand behind the back lean up over the top really stretch that hand up and over and relax couple little torso twists as we go in and well done so from me Matt thank you very much for joining in I hope to see you all really really soon stay safe stay at home most important thing and continue doing all our fantastic workouts with our brilliant instructors talk to you soon bye